So the second important scan to detect inflammation in the shoulder is after the anterior transversal scan is the posterior transversal scan. In the posterior transversal scan, you are um, looking directly in the glenohumeral joint. You see here um, the glenohumeral joint. You see the distension of the capsule. And if I go some um, distally, there is no capsule anymore. And here comes the capsule and the capsule is once again distended with echogenic material. And if you have only a little effusion or a little synovitis, you always should perform a rotation, a little external rotation, a little, very smoothly because the patient has pain in the shoulder. And if you external rotate, you see that the synovial pro proliferation and will go in and out, in and out the joint and in and out the joint space. So this is the second very important scan for us rheumatologists to see if there is any inflammation from the dorsal scan to look at the glenohumeral um, joint. And this is also the, the scan which will I um, use to, for the approach for the injection of the glenohumeral joint. The glenohumeral joint will be injected in this position and you will guide your needle with ultrasound into the, into the joint capsule.